Hey class, now I'm going to show you a little experiment of cognitive mapping. See the man down the hall right there? He gets up every single morning and makes it to the coffee pot when he's half asleep. He'll even tell you himself that sometimes he doesn't know how he makes it there. So we're going to demonstrate his cognitive map of our home in general. He should have a general cognitive map that will lead him from his bedroom all the way to the coffee pot without stumbling much. He may knock into the walls a little bit because he's still trying to get his bearings, but he should make it just fine. So now let's get right into the experiment. Let's see how well his cognitive map works. Bob, can you demonstrate? As you can see, he's blindfolded. We took away his sense of sight just to make sure that this test works. He made it down the hall just fine. Now head towards the kitchen. He's slowly walking towards the kitchen now, as you can see. Now he's in the kitchen. Show him in the kitchen, camera person. Yeah, so he's in the kitchen. He's kind of feeling around. You can take the blindfold off now, Bob. He made it to the coffee pot. Now he gets a big smile on his face. So that's just a little demonstration of a cognitive map. Now we're going to try it with you people in the class. We need two volunteers. We're going to blindfold you and see if you have a cognitive map of the classroom that we've been in for two, about two years. See how well you can make it through there with no eyesight. All right, thank you.